a wonderful day for me and my family. So it happens to be 16th of December 2017. The day of the Lord. The day that uh, God has made for me. And I'm happy to be in this wonderful atmosphere to celebrate my marriage ceremony with um, Lizzie Unubokai. Wow, today is my day, today is a wonderful day for me and my family, today happens to be 16th of December 2017, the day of the Lord, the day that uh, God has made for me and I'm happy to be in this wonderful atmosphere to celebrate my marriage ceremony with um, Lizzie Unubokai. She's a wonderful woman, a woman of my dream, a woman that makes me feel so complete. If not for her, I don't think uh, I'll be the way I am right now. She's so wonderful to me. She makes me so happy. She makes me so complete. And uh, I want to say these things about her. She's a wonderful woman. She gives me a complete home. She makes me feel so complete. And my prayer is that we're going to have a wonderful family together, beautiful kids, live good life, enjoy the, 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 the best of life, enjoy the, the best that life can ever offer to anybody. That is my dream. Spend the rest of our life together, go to different countries, enjoy the good things of life. That is my dream. Because I'm so happy for this wonderful day. My business name is Benny's Glam. I do bridal makeup, I'm the makeup artist, I'm the one doing Lizzie's makeup for a big day. I'm so glad, I'm trying to make her look beautiful for today and she's such a darling. My wishes to you is that God gives you your heart desire, a blessed home and loving children and God will make your home a prosperous one. Thank you so much, Lee. My name is Higat. Wow, I'm just so excited. I'm a fine to the bride. She has been my friend right from year three in school. I'm just so happy for them because today has been, been a day that I've been looking up to. It came like a bomb and of course, it's going to be a bomb. I really love the relationship, the love they share. It's one in town. It makes me believe that there's still love in this thing. And my wish for them today is for them to live happily ever after, for her to achieve her dreams, for her to achieve all her goals. And I wish her well. My name is Brian Margaret. I'm a sheep bridesmaid. She's my very good friend. She's kind, nice. She's a good friend. And I wish that she remain happy forever. Blessing. This is a very good friend of mine. We met 2009 in school and since then she has been a sister to me. My wish for her now is that God should give her the grace, the strength to be a good mother, a good wife, and I pray that God should bestow his blessing upon her marriage. I wish her all this best. Long
marriage was for us to create room for objection. See, this moment as we are speaking, we did not receive any objection from anywhere. Right here at this minute, if you feel you have any objection, why we cannot go ahead to join this couple together as husband and wife, you can signify by raising up your hand so that we should know. Parents are here. Parents of the bride are here. Parents of the groom are here. See, those are the parents of the bride. I believe this young man came to seek your consent for your daughter's hands in marriage. And you give approval of it. Those are the parents of the groom. Your son told you that he will be getting married to this lady. And you give approval of it. So which means the marriage is this full free. We can go ahead and join them together. Now, good Lord Nicholas, we now have this young lady to be the wife, the wedded wife, to live together in the estate of matrimony. We now love her, comfort her, honor her, keep her in sickness and in health, and forsaking all others, keep thee only unto her so long as we both shall live. Now, Elizabeth. We don't have this young man to be thy wedded husband, to live together in the estate of matrimony. We don't love him, serve him, honor him, keep him in sickness and in health, and forsaking all others, keep thee only unto him so long as you both shall live. Okay. Now, we are now in the oath taking. The man will first of all take the oath. We will repeat after we continue looking after your old wife. Is that the woman? Okay. If that is the woman, we repeat after me. I call upon all persons here present to witness that I call your name. Do take the call her name to be my lawful wedded wife. Have and to hold from this day forward for better, for worse, for richer, for poorer, in sickness and in health, to love, cherish, to death do us pass. And there too, I give thee my trust. Now, the woman to do the same by looking at your proposed husband very well. Is that the man? Is that the man? Uh -huh. If that is the man, you repeat after me. I call upon all persons here present to witness that I do take thee to be my lawful wedded husband, to have and to hold from this day forward for better, for worse, for richer. And in her to love, cherish, and to obey, and to obey, and to obey the death to us pass. And there too, I give them a trust. You can face the public now. Ladies and gentlemen, that is the oath taken by the couple. They have chosen to be together for life. Either for better, for worse, for richer, for poorer, in sickness and in health. Hang it upon the fourth finger of the woman's left hand. Hang it, I said, don't push it inside. Hang it and hold on to it. Then you repeat after me. With this ring, with this ring I do wear it. With my body, I do worship. With all my worldly goods, I do endow. You can now unveil her and demonstrate to us how you love your bride. To so my kiss the bride. That is not kiss. Your truth should be flattered to each other. That is kiss. You don't see pet. Uh -huh. That is what you are doing, what I asked you. 
Yeah. The woman will do the same. But take the mass ring from the table. Hang it upon the fourth finger of the mass left hand. Then repeat after me. With this ring, I do work with my body. I do worship with all my worldly goods. I do endow. Push it to size and demonstrate to us how you love the young man. My kiss your room. Now so you do. Now you now so you do. You are the young man. Kiss him more. With the power conferred on me by the Constitution of the Federal Republic of Nigeria, I pronounce them husband and wife. Congratulations.
Italy. The man who has to be raised to one to the feet, Mr. Casey. Minister of that today, if you see him, you don't go know him again. <laughs> Wow. Ladies and gentlemen, are you seeing what I'm seeing? Please, somebody clear the eye for Mr. Chairman to see the video. Mr. Chairman, you need to see this one. Mr. Balogo of Canada, you need to see what's going on here. You need to watch what she's doing. She's, please, somebody clear the eye for Mr. Chairman, please. The eye should be clear for Mr. Chairman. You need to see this one. We need to see this one. Ladies and gentlemen, are you seeing what I'm seeing? Are you seeing what I'm seeing? Now, ladies and gentlemen, we want to watch the man that wants to be the wife. He wants to show you what's wrong. Mr. Chairman, are you seeing what I'm seeing now? He wants to do his own part. He don't clean the mouth. The arranger. He said, my wife, the next spaghetti. Yeah. I see the next shot for you. Ladies and gentlemen, wow. congratulations to Mr. Kessie. Mr. and Mrs. Nicholas. Congratulations to you. Congratulations. Thank you. Thank you. Hello, Mr. Chairman, and Chris, the chain is up on the dancing floor. There's the first star general, Robert Bush. Mr. 
I want to show them, Mr. Chairman, it's about to show them a little, a little level of
I want to thank God for this wonderful day, the marriage ceremony between me and this beautiful woman right beside me. I have so much appreciate because everybody showed up to show me love in this place. So I am so happy and grateful to God for everything. And, uh, and I pray that uh, God should lead all of them back to their various destination. In Jesus' name we pray. I love you so much, baby. This is a wonderful woman. Do my after my heart. Do my for me. Keep watching every multimedia concept TV.